y let's quickly solve for the value of x the first thing we need to do is i want to remove this 27 and i want to remove this x to the power of 2 okay so the first thing i will do is this raised to the power of 27 i'm going to raise each side to the power of 1 over 27 because that's the only way i can remove that 27 okay is equal to 27 to the power of x squared everything raised to the power of 1 over 27 okay now when this cancels this you're left with x okay is equal to but why did i cancel i want you to recall that a to the power of m raised to the power of n is equal to a to the power of m multiplied by n okay so that simply means that okay to avoid too many questions so that simply means that the left hand side is equal to x to the power of 27 multiplied by 1 over 27 is equal to 27 to the power of x squared multiplied by 1 over 27 all right okay then we are going to do what this we now divide this and we have that x is equal to so we have 27 x squared multiplied by 1 we give us x squared divided by what 27 so this one is power x squared divided by 27 is the power of this 27 so we now have that x is equal to 27 raised to the power of x to the power of 2 divided by 27 i re i had to write it again so that it will be clear all right now we continue. I want to remove this x squared. And the only way to do that is to raise each side of this equation by uh, to the power of 1 over x squared. So I will write x raised to the power of 1 over x squared, okay, is equal to 27 raised to the power of x squared divided by 27. Everything raised to the power of 1 over x squared. So we have x to the power of 1 over x squared is equal to 27 to the power of x squared divided by 27 multiplied by 1 over x squared. Okay. All right. Now we have, this is going to divide this. So we have x to the power of 1 over x squared is equal to 27 to the power of, now we have 1 over 27. All right. So x to the power of 1 over x squared is equal to 27 to the power of 1 over 9 multiplied by 3 or 3 multiplied by 9, right? Yeah, if this is the first time you're coming across this channel, please click on the subscription button and on your notification bell so that you don't miss any of our amazing videos, all right? And please give us a thumbs up if you're actually enjoying this video. Thank you so much. Now we have that x to the power of 1 over x squared is equal to 27 to the power of 1 over 3 multiplied by 1 over 9, right? So I'd like you to watch to the end because we're going to substitute whatever we got as our x to this place, okay? To prove that it is right and it's another amazing mathematics experience, okay? All right, now we have... We have x to the power of 1 over x squared, okay, is equal to 27 to the power of 1 over 3, okay. Now, raise the power of 1 over 9. So, we have x to the power of 1 over x squared is equal to, I want us to recall the law of exponent that states that a to the power of m divided by n is equal to the nth root of a raised to the power of m okay so that means that we can write this as what cube root of 27 raised to the power of 1 so it's going to be cube root of what 27 raised to the power of 1 which is still 1 then raised to the power of 1 over 9 okay so we have x to the power of 1 over x squared is equal to cube root of 27 is 3 that is what will you multiply 3 times to get 27 and the answer is 3 so we have 3 raised to the power of what? 1 over 9. So we have x to the power of 1 over x squared is equal to 3 raised to the power of 1 over. Now 9 is still the same thing as 3 squared. 
So it's time to compare. If we compare, we can see that our x is equal to 3 and our x squared is equal to 3 squared. So if we say x is equal to 3, then we have gotten the value of our x. If you also say x squared is equal to 3 squared, by comparison, our x is also equal to 3. Now, to the most amazing part of this video, let's substitute what we got into this place to prove that what we did is correct. Okay? All right. Now, let's do that. Hope you have given us a thumbs up. Please do that if you actually enjoyed this video. So, we got our x to be 3. 3 to the power of 27 is equal to 27 to the power of 3 squared, okay? So we have 3 to the power of 27 is equal to 27 to the power of what? 9. All right. So we have 3 to the power of 27 is equal to 27 is the same thing as 3 to the power of 3, all right? Now raised to the power of what? 9. So we have 3 to the power of 27 is equal to... 3 to the power of 3 times 9 is what? 27. So you can see that the answer is correct. Thank you so much for watching and...